Lu Young, Girls 2008 to 2016. Inspired by Lu Young's own adolescent struggles, the Girl series explores vulnerability, insecurity, and womanhood through the portrayal of China's youth culture. Louise Bourgeois with Tracy Emin, When My Can't Stop Living, 2009 to 2010. When My Can't Stop Living reveals the often unregarded emotional complexity of pregnancy. The two artists portray a lingering sense of loss while uncovering the unspoken sorrow of abortion and miscarriage. Tom Wood, anyone got any hairspray? Tom Wood captures 1980s club kids at the Chelsea Reach. A regular himself, Wood presents the working class community and youth's drunken activity against a backdrop of economic hardship. Henry Matisse, Dance, 1910. Dance depicts harmonious and spiritual community. Matisse does not focus on the dancer's individual appearance, but rather on the movement and rhythm they create together. Tim Silver, Oneirophrenia. Silver's Oneirophrenia series presents a typology of self-portraits. The busts are filled with raw bread dough, which, as it rises, breaks through the figure's plaster skin. Edgar Invoker, Enter 2011. Enter portrays Invoker's own experience with lucid dreams, illustrating the transitional state between the conscious and unconscious. Eva Schlegel. In Between, 2010 to 2011. The work in between consists three propellers with a diameter of 3.5 meters each. These serve as backdrops for the projection of Stiegel's moving images of human flying and falling, depicting the theme of success and failure. Psychedelic Art, Experiment on the Effect of LSD on Artists' Creativity. 1950s. The artwork records this artist's journey in between states of lunacy and lucidity. Richard Dat, The Fairy Fellers Master Strick, 1855 to 1864. Dad was sent to Bethlehem Hospital for suffering from severe paranoid schizophrenia and for murdering his father. This painting presents figures entirely drawn from the artist's imagination. Bailey Liu, The Mending Project. The Mending Project consists of 1,500 pairs of iron scissors suspended from the ceiling. On the floor, a white cloth with black stitch lays bare. This contrast alludes to feelings of violence and unpredictability. Bailey Liu employs the notion of mending to transform fear into healing. Mm -hmm.